Machine learning is a complicated process with inputs that can be overwhelming for many. The processes that experts have developed are very similar to the steps and processes of the general community. In other words, the ML workflow is infrastructure that will make or break the success of a project. I know I've talked about foundations in many of the lessons, and model deployment workflow is no different. In order for a model to succeed, the data flowing into that model needs to be of the highest quality. This is why you may hear the term garbage in, garbage out. When machine learning engineers look at the data that they'll be using to build their model, it is of the utmost importance for it to be as clean and usable as possible. Consistency is important for experts. Think of the workflow like an application on your phone. If you clicked the same button twice, you would assume the same action would repeat itself. Workflows need to be very similar. In order to provide consistency, there are options available to allow the creation of datasets and processing of information to be repeatable. This allows the sharing and collaboration of workflows. When building the models, constraints may be put in place that need to be taken into consideration when building the workflow. There usually are finite resources available to create workflows, such as limited compute resources, costs for iterating on the workflow, or product timelines that demand a solution to be delivered. Lastly, experts think seriously about how evaluation plays in the story of the model workflow, mainly because evaluation is the end result. If you have a workflow with an incorrectly used metric, how valid is your model? This has downstream effects, which can lead to failure of the goal. There is a tremendous amount of pressure on getting the ML workflow correct. May this bring insight and appreciation to the topics that experts often need to think about.